Welcome back. Today we're playing this game called Snail's Pace Race from Ravensburger. It's for two to six players ages three and up. The maker of the game says, a snail's pace will win the race, and describes the game like this. Six colorful garden snails are ready to race. Which snail will come in first and which will come in last? Ready, set, go little snails. The game comes with only a few pieces. A pretty colorful board. Six different colored snails. And two dice with different colors on them. The game has multiple variations, but they all start the same. Place each snail on its corresponding leaf color. The game can be played as a competitive game or a cooperative game, which is a cool feature that not many games have. We will first start with the competitive game, which actually has variations to it. The object of the game is to correctly guess which snail will cross the line first and last. Each player first guesses which snail will cross the line first and last. The youngest player goes first and rolls both dice at the same time. Based on the colors shown in the die, they move the corresponding colored snails one space forward for each color shown. If both dice are the same color, then the snail moves two spaces. Play continues until all the snails cross the finish line. There are two winners in this game. The player who picks the first snail to cross the finish line and the player who picked the last snail to cross the finish line. The maker of the game offers variations and encourages changing the game to make it different and more exciting. We have played where each player selects just one snail and the first one to cross the finish line is the winner. Depending on the number of players, each player may even have two snails with the first two snails crossing the finish line declared the winner. We have also played where the winner is the first person to get both of their snails across the finish line. We have also played where the last snail to cross the finish line is the winner. We have also played this game cooperatively. That means we work together and try to beat uh, an opponent that's not really there. We either all win together or we all lose together. We select three snails and try to get them across the finish line before the other three snails. For example, we might pick the pink, blue, and orange snails and compete against the red, yellow, and green snails. On a scale of one to six snails, I would give this game four snails. It's fun and great for younger players. It helps young learners with colors and counting. It's a very quick game, and a snail is basically always moving on every turn. The game is so quick, the maker says 15 minutes, but we found it to be more like five minutes. So you can just play and play again. That helps young players who get upset when they lose. Also, you can root for the snails, not necessarily the player which cuts down on some of those <clears throat> difficult childhood behaviors that competitive games bring out in some kids. I hope you enjoyed this review and learn how to play the game. Be sure to subscribe to see more family fun games and activities.